Hello everyone, uh, I'm going to show you here how to make an artificial star. An artificial star is a point source of light and it is used for uh, collimating telescopes and uh, making sure that uh, they are not uh, out of collimation. So what I did here is that this is just simply a piece of aluminum foil from your, from your kitchen and a small uh, flashlight from the dollar store costs like two dollars and the rubber band the important thing is to get uh, a fine um, sewing needle the finest you can have check with your mom or with your wife and see what's her, in her collection and then put the aluminum uh, uh, foil on a, a hard surface I used a magazine and uh, just you know prick a small hole uh, with very little pressure and then a little bit more and then a little bit more until you get these different stars and then i placed it on a the farthest place i can uh, place it in in my home and I'll, then i'll show you what i did on the telescope okay so here i am with the with the telescope the telescope is a uh, Celestron uh, C8 just uh, your usual Schmidt Cassegrain telescope and it was a bit out of collimation and what I did here is that I focused on the on the artificial star at the very end of the house and then I used the zoom feature in the in the camera so I, I attached the DSLR to it because I use it for uh, for astrophotography so what I did is here is, uh, is just use a higher magnification and then you can see the star okay this is not gonna show this is not gonna show correctly here but okay so let's move it okay so so here are the stars the So here is here is one star. Here is another, and here is another. Uh, they unfortunately they don't show well in the uh, doing an LCD. But if I defocus them, then you can see that I get the donut shape. Uh, it's much better on the on the LCD screen of the of the DSLR. But you can see that it is uh, concentric, and actually I can I can focus a bit more here by ten times, and there is the donut. And this is out focus, and this is the in focus. So this is if when it is in focus, and then the other side of the focus. Okay, and I can move through different magnitude of stars if I want to. Uh, there is another one. There is another one. And there is a very faint one. Okay, so. Very easy to do, costs like two dollars or uh, or so, and uh, you don't need to buy the twenty dollars or the twenty five dollars plus shipping uh, ones that that are available from uh, from various sources. Just make your own. And there there are other stars here, um, and what what you want to do is to check the uh, concentricity of the donut. Okay, there's a little bit of of unevenness here between the, the the top and the back so I need to find where that is so it's it's this side that needs adjustment okay anyway so go ahead and, and do your own um, uh, artificial star 